Hey guys, this video will be a tutorial on this look. I've been loving white eyeliner lately and I think it's so fun and perfect for summer. So let's get started. So starting off with the face, I'm going to be taking my NYX Angel Veil Primer and applying that all over my face. Next I'll be going in with my L'Oreal True Match Foundation. This is in the shade W7 Caramel Beige. And I like to apply my foundation with a foundation brush first and then I'll go in and blend it with a sponge afterwards. Instead of using concealer, I just prefer to go over with a little bit more foundation in the places that I need it, which is usually on my nose, my cheeks, and my forehead. Next I'll be using my NYX HD concealer in beige under my eyes, and then I'm going to blend everything out with my Real Technique sponge. For powder, I'm going to be using the Maybelline Fit Me in 240 Golden Beige. This is the original formula. They also have a matte formula if you prefer a more matte finish. For bronzer, I'm going to be using the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. This is just a baby sample I got forever ago. And I'm not going to be contouring, I'm just going to apply this to the face to give myself some warmth. For highlight, I'm using the Baby Doll Beauty Cosmetics Highlighter in Moonshine. Mine looks crazy right now because it actually broke and I had to repress it. So I'm going to be applying this on my cheekbones, forehead, down the center of my nose, my cupid's bow, and on my chin. Once it's applied, I like to go in with a kabuki brush and blend it out. And then if I'm feeling a little bit more glowy than normal, I'll go in with a duo fiber brush and the highlight and apply a little bit more. And for whatever reason, this part didn't film, but for blush, I am using the NYX Baked Blush in Chiffon. And oh, I just love this color, but I like to apply this with a duo fiber brush so it isn't so intense. For brows, I just did my usual and I outlined with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade in Dark Brown. And then I filled them in using the NYX Eyebrow Cake Powder in Dark Brown. If you would like to see a brow routine, then just let me know. So for primer, I'm using the NYX HD Eye Primer as always, and I'm applying this all over my lid, on the inner corner, and on the bottom lash line as well. And I forgot to get a product shot of this, but I'm taking the Rimmel Soft Eye Cordial in white. I'm applying that to the inner corner and I'm going to be applying it on my lid and into the crease and then blending it out with my finger. Alright, so using the new NYX Avant Pop Palette in Surreal My Heart, I'm going to be taking this beautiful matte peach shade and I'm going to apply that everywhere I put the white base. Mm -hmm. 
Next, taking this rosy taupe shade, I'm going to apply this to my crease. And then I'm just going to use my face powder to blend around that taupe color. To brighten up the inner corner, I'm going to take this shimmery white shade on a pencil brush and just apply that to my inner tear duct area. Next, taking this matte brown shade, I'm going to apply that to my bottom lash line. Next, I'll be taking my pitiful L'Oreal Voluminous Smoldering Eyeliner in black and lining my tight line. I decided to smoke out the bottom lash line a little bit more. So taking this matte black shade, I'm going to apply this on the outer third of the bottom lash line and then I'm gonna smoke it out using that brown shade with a pencil brush. Next, I'm going to line my top lash line using the NYX White Liquid Liner. Mascara, I'm using the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. For lashes, I'm going to be wearing the Oh My Lash Anya Mink Lashes and applying it with the Ilor Lash Fix in black. it for the eyes. To line my lips, I'm going to be using the NYX Lip Liner in Peekaboo Neutral. And for my lip color, I'm going to be using the Wet n Wild Mega Last Lipstick in Bear It All. All right, so that's it for this look. I hope that you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you on my next one. Bye. Hard. And we were drowned in the mountain